Hi everybody, my name is Lisa Lorbrecht and I'm the Retreat Specialist and I'm so excited to be bringing you this Lemurian and Atlantis Retreat in Kauai in November with the beautiful Antoinette Nichols. I thought I would do a really quick video because I wanted to talk about and explain my experience in Kauai just over the last couple of weeks. So it was my first trip there and my very first retreat to Hawaii and now it's manifested into the only place I've been doing retreats for quite a while. That's the messages I'm getting. So first of all, let me tell you about Jeannie and Dawn and Dolphin Touch Wellness Centre. It is such a beautiful um, place to meet and to gather and it'll be where we'll have our opening ceremony and some of our workshops and some of our gatherings while we're on this Lemurian Atlantis retreat. I had of course heard of Atlantis as most people have um, by watching movies, hearing stories, knowing other people that have had past lives there and them talking to them about, um, about them to me. But I had never heard of Lemuria and so for me it was quite interesting. But I want to specifically tell you about a couple of the um, things we'll be doing. One is a dolphin energetic session in the water at Salt Pond, which is a sacred place in Kauai. Um, and that's with Jeannie and Dawn. And for me, they're, you know, putting the words together is quite difficult. So for me, it's what it is, you go in the water and you go in there with intention and Jeannie supports you with some floats on your neck and your legs and the water's only like not even waist high. So you're not in deep water and it's very sheltered. It's got like a, 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 a wall, a stone wall, so there's no big waves coming in or anything like that. And so you get in the water and you're lying there and you've got a life, um, like a life jacket on as well. So when you're lying there, Jeannie maneuvers you through the water. So you're flowing and you're moving all the time and you, I had earplugs in so I couldn't hear very much but I do remember sounds of the ocean but for me I, I it finished and it is really difficult to get out of the water so dawn is there to reground you and for you to refocus and come back to the present because for me the first thing I, I felt was it was like a baptism and with all the other things that we did on the retreat it flowed right into this and I came out of the water feeling quite different, really energized, really focused. I It did take me quite a while to reground and, and Dawn takes you through a process of with singing bowls and a flute um, to, to bring you back into the present realm, I guess. And so for me, that was quite an experience. And then I was saying to the other girls on the retreat that if this is all it is, then I'm happy, I'm happy to go home tomorrow, but it wasn't over yet. So our full day, and I'm not gonna tell you a lot about it, but I wanna tell you about what I experienced at Waimera Canyon. And as I said, I had never really heard of Lemuria before. And so Jeannie is there telling the story. So we're looking over this amazing canyon and I will post a photo while, you know, you can hear me talking. So Jeannie is talking about the Lemurians and how a lot of them were wiped out when a big, a big like flood or tsunami came and how people lost each other. And I just started crying, like it wasn't loud dramatic crying it was just these tears started flowing and I knew instinctively that I had been there that I had lost people and that pain I felt was 
so real, like I never could have imagined. And it was quite unexpected. And there's crowds of people there. So I knew people were looking at us and there were some blokes going, oh, you know, listen to that load of shit type thing. But it was so real. And then she was talking about how some of the Lemurian goddesses and priestesses stayed. So they stayed with the people who couldn't get out. And they then helped the people with their passing and the floods are coming. And I knew, again, I just knew that I was one of these people, these women that stayed to help the passing of their people be a little bit easier. And from that became a whole awakening. I can't even begin to describe it fully to you. You will understand when you're there. And they say most people have had Lemurian or Atlantis or Avalonian lives and that they've been in all three. I've never had a connection to Atlantis um, other than the fascination, but I have to, well now Lemuria and particularly Avalon in the UK and, and Europe. So for me, this awakening explained um, fears that I have of water, irrational fears like fears. I never had an experience with water that I could pinpoint. That's why I'm scared of water. I it made sense to some things and I was thinking and, and feeling that I've had those feelings all my life. This retreat for me, even though I was a facilitator, was so transformational and I've come home so totally different. And I hope that you'll ask any questions that you have about this retreat. Antoinette and I are so excited and, and also to be connecting you with um, Jeannie and Dawn at Dolphin Touch Wellness Centre. I cannot wait to share this with you. I cannot wait to explore this further, not only for myself, but to watch those awakenings in, in some of you. And what we've got planned is truly phenomenal. So have a read, ask any questions you have. We've only got 10 spaces and I know a couple of those are already filled. So I look forward to hearing from you as does Antoinette and I look forward to connecting with you. Have a great day. Bye.